back to my channel. So, today I'm going to be kind of remodeling my tarantula enclosure. So, Newt is pretty young, honestly, so I'm not giving him a whole new big cage or anything. He's still too small. But I'm going to be going through and changing the substrate and adding some new things for him and trying to get him to eat because he has not been eating. So, uh, I'm going to look for signs of pre-molt because I haven't seen him up close in a little while because he normally hides on the top of his uh, tank so I can't really see him. I can't see him because his lid is black. So, yeah, let's get started. This is Newt's tank right now. And he's right here, you can see him. So, I'm just gonna... One second. Got him out. He's right there. So, um, I'm gonna try to make this quick because I don't want him to be in there for long. I'm gonna go ahead and like wipe it down off camera because that's kind of boring. Now, uh, that's basically it. I don't have anything else to put in there. And you're probably going to comment that either the water dish is too big, which, if you haven't seen Exotic's video, Exotic Flayer's video, uh, proving to you that tarantulas can't drown, then go watch that. Also, if you're wondering, since my tarantula is a Vigilera, or pink toe, whatever you call it, um, why well, I don't have anything tall that he can climb on, and that's because I did have something that I made myself that I put in there for him to climb on. It was really tall, but he never used it. He just likes to climb on the top and the side parts of it instead. So, yeah, I'm offering him this in case he wants to come down and hide, but... Probably he'll end up just climbing on the top sides of it. Hopefully not building a web again because it makes it really difficult for me to open it without him falling. So yeah, we're just giving him this down here so he can molt. Um, and yeah, so he can have this place to hide if he wants it. But most likely he won't even use it. So that's that. So. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna try to put him in here, back in here, but, yeah, I had the doobie roach right there, and it was literally touching him, and he just did not care, so, I don't know, his, he looks pretty black on his abdomen to me, look at those fangs, though, so cool. So, yeah, let's try and put him back in here. I'm going to set the camera back right there. Let's see if we can get him back in here without him freaking out on me. So. Okay, so that was it for this week's video. I'm going to be posting every Wednesday from now on. 
So, yeah, I'm sorry it was kind of short today, but, uh, this is all I had to post, and I did not know what else to film. So, yeah, this is, that's, that's this video this week, so, yeah, sorry about that. Not that anyone cares, though, so, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell to become part of my plaza as well as become notified every time I upload a new video. I kind of got a little study there for a second, but yeah, as always, until next time, goodbye. <laughs>